no YouTube. Um, all right, well, we have uh, this is a continuation video for yesterday yesterday's video about getting into the recovery console. Now we know how to get into the recovery console. Um, of course, this is for users with Windows XP uh, computers. All right. Um, and we're gonna cre we're we're creating this video to uh, show the steps on um, well the steps to resolve this particular error here um, in a in a way that everyone or a non tech savvy can uh, actually follow. All right. So our our error is um, is that it says that this file is either missing or corrupt so windows system 32 config slash system that's basically is the system registry or, or is the, is the uh, registry file if you uh, go to the registry editor um, you'll see that and sorry you know you know what I mean um, let me uh, let me show you uh, this is rather that of a uh, let me show you how does this file looks like in in your registry editor. I'm gonna show you um, I'm gonna show you that of Windows Windows 7, but it's pretty much similar to that in Windows XP. So this file system is actually it's here. This is it. This is the file. All, all the settings here all those stuff all those information is not readable to the operating system right now that's why um, your operating system is not turning on so what we need, need to do is to uh, take a look if there's a copy of if, if there's a copy of this um, saved by the system restore uh, if there is then we need to copy it from that location to this location and that should take care of it. Okay, so we gonna we must have a the operating system CD installed and uh, well uh, inserted. And this is a virtual machine, and I had it inserted in here. And then we're gonna restart your computer. All right, so at this point we just press Control Delete or reset it. Okay, and there it goes. All right, so we're going to the recovery console. I press R here. Okay. okay, we only have one Windows installation. It only displays one. Uh, you may have two. So just choose the number that is associated with the um, operating system that you wanna you wanna troubleshoot in the recovery console. Uh, make sure to press the number first before you press enter. Otherwise, it's gonna exit out of the recovery console. Administrator password is required. Uh, however, if you don't have password for the administrator account just leave it blank press enter all right so uh, first up you need to go to C CD C colon slash it's actually system volume information but to get it short you just type system squiggly line one all right and it says access denied um, at this point, you just need to delete the current uh, system, although it's n it's corrupted. That's why uh, you're getting the error message. So we're just going to delete it. So type in DEL uh, system32 backspace config backspace system. Right, but you need to restart your computer. Type exit, press enter. It's gonna reboot. Now we're gonna boot back to the recovery console. So when the uh, CD prompts, uh, press any key right away. Okay, so press R. Press one. Press enter. So right now we don't. We have deleted the uh, system file. So. Okay, we, we're gonna go back to the system volume information. So CD or change directory space C colon slash 
system volume information but we're just gonna type system squiggly line one that means that it will change to the first directory that qualifies um, you know that starts with with uh, system all right and then um, we're gonna go to the restore uh, restore folder it's Risto squiggly line one all right, then we're gonna choose the um, the restore point. Now they they they're saved in folders, so we're just gonna check which one is the latest and which one is the applicable for us. Um, okay, so we have uh, well, we got ten restore points over here. Um, RP three, four, five, six, seven, uh, and so on, and ten. All right, then there, are, there, there is a date. Nine, nine of ten, eight, eleven of ten, and things like that. You're just gonna need to choose um, uh, when do you think uh, your computer was still working fine. In my case, I'm just gonna use restore point, and that restore point was created on the September 9, 2010. So CD or change directory RP 10. Alright, 10 backspace snapshot. Alright, so um, we're gonna copy file from uh, from this folder uh, just to make sure. Let's go ahead and um, check out what's in this uh, directory there. Um, you see, these are the registry files registry underscore machine uh, security software system. Uh, those are what you see when your registry uh, editor when you type in reg edit when you're when you're in inside Windows. Uh, right now we need to copy um, this one re registry underscore machine underscore system to the location that is displayed in the error message. We might as well just go ahead and copy uh, registry and machine software just to be sure about it. Alright, so we're gonna go into the last part. So it's copy underscore registry underscore machine underscore soft uh, system space C colon. This is the location, uh, the destination folder. Windows system 32 slash config slash system. Alright, copy the one file. Now we're gonna do uh, pretty much the same with the software. So uh, software space. Make sure though that you, you don't mistakenly type in the um, destination uh, destination uh, file config slash software. Alright, otherwise it's gonna resort to the same error. Uh, this one is asking you to overwrite software file because it's still there. We didn't delete it unlike the system file. Okay, so we're gonna press Y to confirm it. And there it goes, it's copied. So we're gonna exit out, exit it out. We're gonna boot back to the operating system. This should be able to, um, to uh, well, we should be able to uh, load the operating system now we're not gonna press anything in there because we still have the CD but we're not booting into the CD alright alright so um alright so there goes we don't have the error message now but whatever we have or well, whatever problems we have um, when uh, well during the time of the restoration uh, that we still have that one. If you have vi virus infection, you're gonna need. You're still gonna need to um, resolve your malware infections um, and anything else. All right. Well, thank you for watching this video. I hope uh, you find this helpful. Um, all right. Well, um, please visit my website. Ask for anything there. Ask for any help. Uh, I'll try to give you what I can. And uh, by the way, this is in rep uh, response to Miss Angelita's post on my website. Really appreciate that, and uh, have a great day.